of July celebration. Dallas on Tavares joins us live from Alamona Beach Park with the very latest. Morning, Dallas. Good morning, Kelly and Ross. Well, we've been having such a fun time for the last few hours of Wake Up Today and now into Take Two, just learning what families are doing to celebrate the 4th of July and really just checking out the fireworks, which are set to be lit at 8.30. So there's still plenty of time to head on over here and spend time with family and friends. But right now, I am catching up with some family right here, some Ohana. We got Jay from Eva Beach. Good morning, Jay. Hey, morning, morning. And then we got Jason from Waipahu. Good morning, Jason. Aloha, aloha. And these two are cousins. They brought their whole family family out for this. They've been doing this for just years, a long-lasting tradition. Let me tell, let me ask you, Jay, what makes you come out here year after year? Oh, celebrating Independence Day, you know, what better way to do that with than with family and friends? Mm -hmm. Enjoying this uh, perfect weather, you know, Absolutely. coming out to the beach, especially because it's hot. And, and <laughs> it is hot, let me tell you that. I mean, if you just look at their setup, everyone, I got to say, this is a very impressive setup. They already got breakfast cooking. They got the coolers. You see some beds in the background. I mean, they really plan accordingly for this. So I want to ask you, Jason, is there anything specific you guys do for Fourth of July, like any family tradition, any food items you guys always cook on Fourth of July? Oh, definitely. Um, that's, that's what it's all about. We like cooking, and we got a whole bunch of uh, cooks here. So this morning, we, pre we prepared uh, uh, a local deluxe uh, breakfast. We got spam, mm -hmm. Portuguese sausages, eggs. Of course, you cannot forget the rice. Nope, you can't forget about the steamed rice. Then we got our uh, specialty, Hannah. She got her uh, pork belly. Hannah with the <laughs> pork belly. All right, Hannah. I gotta ask you, what? You're, so, are you going live with me? Okay, we got some inception going on here. So, Hannah, if you could just pay attention to the camera right here, what is it about your pork belly that makes you cook it every Fourth of July? Um, that's what everybody's favorite, but unfortunately, I can't share the recipe. It's my special hands. <laughs> of course. Yeah, but you guys can have it. Oh. Come back lunchtime. <laughs> All right, it's it's coming around lunchtime then. Yeah, it's lunchtime. And, and I want to ask you, you know, 4th of July is really just about celebrating our independence. It's America's birthday, but it's also a great time to bring family and friends together. What is it about food that really has that effect on people on these holidays? Um, it's about, like, cooking good food. Everybody's craving for it. Like, oh, when are we cooking again? But, you know, it's good. Like, food brings everybody together. Hey, uh-huh. That's Hawaii tradition. There we go. Thank you so much, Hannah. Bye, Hannah's in. Instagram. <laughs> and you know, we're going to be hanging out here for just a little bit more. But if you want any last minute details when it comes to celebrating the 4th of July, you can go ahead and check our website at cagewind2.com. But don't forget, the show starts at 8 30. 8 30. Don't forget, sending it back to you, Ross and Kelly, with more. <laughs> Thanks so much, Dallas. Ooh, I love it. All right. I think we need to head down there for lunch. I know, right? You got the invite and you got to go. We're on Instagram Live. Got to have everything <laughs> happening. I love it. And then again, also, when you go out and watch the fireworks show, keep a lookout for that Wake Up Today firework. Yep. Oh, yeah. So cool. All right. Coming up, we'll break down the top stories that you need to know about next on Take Two. And you can catch him at two, a huge two day concert coming.